Hi, I'm Lloyd Cole, three times Welsh champ and British and Welsh team coach. I run and own my own surf academy here in Swansea in South Wales and today we're going to talk about learning to surf. In this video we're going to run through how to put a surfboard on roof rack. So first off, you need a surfboard, a car and some roof straps, okay? So you need two roof straps to secure a board onto a roof rack. Um, so put your roof, put your straps on the floor. So you can actually put your board on your roof rack, okay? Fins paint, um, pointing forward or fins pointing away. Completely your choice, okay? But what I always suggest is on a surfboard, you get a rocker, which means it bends this way. So you can see the shape on that surfboard, it actually bends this way, yeah? So actually for your, the aerodynamics on your car, is always put it bending that way on the roof. So, like so, plonk it on top of your car, on your roof rack. So that's on there, okay? So what we need to do now is get our roof straps. So the roof straps, you'll need two, but I'm just gonna show you how to secure one, and then you do the same at the back of the surfboard. So it's a nice, long, sturdy cord with a toggle on one side and nothing on the other side. So it goes straight through the toggle and you could pull it tight. So what I need to do first off is put it onto the car this side, like so. Pull it so it's about medium, so it's like that. Pass it over so you can actually place it on the surfboard whilst you walk around the other side. So it's secured on the other side of the car. So we don't want to get it tangled now. So you pull the cord without the toggle towards you. Place the toggle on your surfboard, get the end, pass it through the other side of your roof rack. Now a good tip is, if you don't put a twist in your roof strap, it's gonna sound like you've got bees on your roof. It's just gonna go zzzz the whole time, okay? So actually, just put a few twists in your strap, get your toggle, place the end through, and pull. As you can see now, I'm just applying pressure. There we go. I've applied enough pressure now that the board isn't moving, okay? Now, so many times you'll see boards by the side of the road flying off roof racks, okay? And this is purely down to not pulling your strap tight enough. Always use proper roof straps that you can buy on the internet or in a surf shop. If you use bungee cords, they are bungee, they're stretchy. So as soon as your car gets up to speed, they're gonna stretch and sometimes they snap. So always use the proper roof straps. So that, is how to put a surfboard on a roof rack. <laughs>